So the United Nations, an organization which is supposed to help Africa save us, as they say, is robbing us right in front of our eyes. That and more in this video. Let's get straight into the video. This UN tank that you are seeing right here had an accident yesterday and the driver died on the spot. Only for the residents and citizens to go and check, the tank was filled with gold. Now I have to understand that this is the United Nations we're talking about. We're not talking about some random company which just went there. An organization made to be there for the people, to help us Africans, which are going through it. We are starting to understand the plot. We're starting to understand what they're doing. They're there to destroy, they're there to disrupt us, to get us fighting amongst each other. And when we're fighting, we're focused on hating each other. And the more we hate each other, the more they can come there and just extract that beautiful gold. I heard that France has the third biggest gold reserve in the world. Think, where have they gotten that gold from? This guy had a whole tank full with gold. The people mineral, all those green bags you see over there. So, so gold, stuck with gold from DRC Congo. It's mind boggling to know that these gold reserves that France have, all these European countries, they came from Africa. This is not just like, we're not talking about like one truck. Think of all the trucks which are there coming in and out, in and out every day. You see a war, you see them come there, they're filming and then they say, if you, if you shoot the United Nations, if you attack them, you attack the whole world. We're not hearing anybody saying anything about this. You're not hearing any, anybody from France or whoever saying anything about this. They're just quiet because they're caught red-handed. No wonder why the people of DR Congo are chasing the United Nations troops away. So this is what they are doing. Guys, every country that have United Nations troops they are there looting from the people. These UN peacekeepers are sent by the puppet master, the West. They create this conflict in different countries around the continent where a lot of resources are. I talk about this a lot of time on my TikTok. Create all the terrorist fashion group. Once the country is running heter scatter, they have these people come in as UN peacekeepers. Don't know that the poor citizen of the country do not know that these guys are the real terrorists. I haven't heard anything about any, anybody retracting this because it's true. This is what they're doing and this is why they go to Africa. There's also a plot. Why do, you, why do you think they're not in other countries? It's because they look at Africans as apes, stupid retards, monkeys. That's what they look at Africans as. But how long these people have been doing these things? Carrying the people, natural resources, with the United Nations tank. I think there's a Bible verse which says this best. Beware of the wolf which come in sheep's clothing. I'm beyond upset when I watch this. Anyway, guys, uh, like, comment, and share. And tell me what you guys think about what's happening in Africa right now. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.